everyone, this is Bonnie from Backward Story, and welcome to another edition of Mad About Nails. This week, to celebrate the new Superman movie that just came out, Man of Steel, um, I decided to make my nails um, represent Superman um, to honor him and all of his movies and comics and everything. So, um, I created a nail design based on that. And I um, have a picture of Superman himself one of his shirt that is slightly open revealing his uniform underneath two sideways French tips and then the Superman logo so that is what I did to make my nails and I used all of this product um, I started with Orly Bonder and this creates a rubberized base coat to help it stick longer and then I started with the base coat of my thumb and to get the pinky color, um, the pale fleshy color, I used uh, OPI in Steady As She Rose, which is from the Pirates of the Caribbean um, on Stranger Tides collection and probably pretty hard to find now. And then for the um, shirt um, underneath, I use this whitish gray color. This is called uh, My Boyfriend Scales Walls, and it's actually from last year's OPI Amazing Spider-Man collection when that movie came out, and I probably shouldn't have uh, mixed Marvel and DC, Spider-Man and Superman together, but um, this is my favorite white to use because it's less chalky looking, and the wind is really loud. I'm sorry. The weather has not been great this week. And for my final set of bases, I used Ulta in Indigo, and this is from their denim collection a couple of years back. I don't know if you can buy the colors on their own or not, um, but I did that for these three bases. And then um, I let everything um, dry a little bit, and then um, I put a uh, red coat on top of the blue for the French tips. And I use China Glaze in Red Santa, or no, it says Red Satin, sorry. This is from one of the uh, holiday collections. And then um, after I did the red tips, I came over to my thumb again and um, to make the black sideways French tip of his hairline, I used Wet and Wild uh, Wild Shine in Black Cream. And then for his eyes and for the dots on the um, shirt, I used um, the same black and I used a dotting, dotting tool from MASH and it comes with five of them but only four are in there at the moment. And I just dotted them on to make the eyes and the buttons and then to make the lines at the top and the swirl of his hair. I used uh, Stripe Right So Easy in black, and this is something you can buy at Sally's Beauty Salon. And then I let, um, then then I did a, a blue stripe going down the middle in the same indigo color for the shirt. And then I let everything dry a little bit again. And then um, I used this yellow. It is by Ulta. It is called Sensational. Sun hyphen sensational, and I used it um, on a paint palette with um, a brush from MASH, and it comes with a bunch of brushes. Oh, are they upside down? There they are. A bunch of brushes. So I used um, one of my detail brushes to um, put the yellow here and here. And I also used the brush when I used the red to make the rest of the logo. And again, I used Red Satin by China Glaze. And then I topped everything off with Revlon Quick Dry Top Coat. And I was going out to dinner and um, I didn't want my nails to smudge or anything when I was out. So I actually used Orly Spritz Dry on top of it. Um, which is something that was from Sally's Beauty Salon that um, one of the clerks had convinced me to get at one point a couple of months ago, and I haven't tried it yet. And I don't know if you can tell in the video or not. It's probably going to be really blurry. But I've got some funny um, bubble dots, like not bubbles, but like little uh, grayish spots that are in the uh, polish itself on that finger. And I don't know if it's because 
the top coat and the spritz dry didn't interact well with one another um but it's not very happy with me um and this finger came out weird and the pink and then one of the Frenches came out weird on my other hand as well but so I don't really know if it was because of mixing the two top coats together and I did it maybe half an hour after the first top coat but you never know um, anyway this is what I did to celebrate the release of the new Superman movie and then the other thing I'm going to do to celebrate is go see epic today and not see Superman, but that's another story completely. Um, that is everything for me this week. This is everything I used, and I will talk to you again next week. Have a great weekend. Enjoy the movie. Bye.